Dear students, today we will discuss sulfacetamide. Sulfacetamide, it is a very common drug and belongs to sulfonamide. Sulfonamide, as we have discussed, sulfacetamide belongs to category of sulfonamide. Sulfonamide basically that belongs to the antibacterial activity or antibacterial class. Okay, now come to the how it is a back antibacterial, come to the mechanism of action. Uh, as we have discussed in, with, uh, in the trimethoprim or cotrimoxazole also, that is para-amino benzoic acid, that is also known as PAPA. PAPA, uh, PAPA form folic acid in presence of dihydroteroid synthesis. Uh, folic acid abbreviated as FA. That after um, reduced by mean of dihydrofolate reductase into dihydrofolic acid, also known as or abbreviated as DHFA. Okay, that DHFA means dihydrofolic acid again reduced to tetrahydrofolic acid in presence of dihydrofolate reductase. Means we add both steps. Both steps, uh, same enzyme is there. Clear? Now, the tetrahydrofolic acid also abbreviated as a THFA. Okay, that, uh, that is the responsible for the conversion of uridylic acid to thymidylic acid. Thymidylic acid is the component of DNA means which is essential for the DNA synthesis. That uh, and DNA component is a part of the chromosomes. Chromosomes means that is the nucleus. Nucleus means the cell formation. Okay. Now, this is the general mechanism followed by uh, all bacterial cell as well as human being cells. Okay. Now, uh, what is the mechanism of sulfacetamide? Sulfacetamide. Uh, structure is the analog of PABA. PABA is the structure this one. PABA is this one that C double O H and NH2. This one the PABA and sulfacetamide the our structure the sulfacetamide this one that uh, sulfacetamide and PABA uh, have similar structure means uh, what will happen sulfacetamide competitively inhibition uh, for the dihydroteroid synthesis means sulfacetamide inhibit this step due to PABA analog or structure resemble with the PABA okay that's why it in this inhibition this step is inhibited followed by all steps are inhibited which results no formation of thymidylic acid from uridylic acid uh, followed by no DNA synthesis, no chromosome, no nucleus or no cell. Means the bacteria will not grow or not um, multiply differently. Means sulfacetamide in a normal dose concentration that is the bacteriostatic. Bacteriostatic means the drug which inhibits the growth of microorganisms. Okay. If we will give the higher concentration of sulfacetamide then we, it will uh, act as a bacteriocidal nature. Clear? This is the mechanism of action as we have again. I must say that it is a competitive inhibitor. I must say it is a competitive inhibitor. Competitive inhibitor for dihydroteroid synthesis. Now, on the basis of this action or mechanism action, its uses are like this. These main two uses that is first use that the treatment of conjunctivitis means conjunctivitis means eye infection uh, we are treating in that conjunctivitis conjunctiva conjunctiva means uh, it is related to eyes again next uh, uses that is the component of triple sulfur and what is the triple sulfur as we have discussed earlier also again I am um, uh, giving the example ben sulfa benzamide, sulfa cetamide and sulfa thiazo. These are the known as a triple sulfa and number of times. I must say number of times um, num different competitive exams like GP, DCO, pharmacist exam number of times it, it is it has been asked as what is a triple sulfur and triple sulfur is used for the treatment of what vaginitis that is 
caused by a bacteria Haemophilus vaginalis. Okay, this, this, uh, these two uses of sulfacetamide means first one treatment of conjunctivitis and the next one is the as a component of triple sulfur which is used for the vaginitis. Okay, this is uh, about the mechanism action as well as the uh, usage of sulfacetamide. Now come to the usage or sorry synthesis of sulfacetamide. Sulfacetamide is a very simple molecule as, as much as simple as we have discussed the ben, ben, what is the sulfonamide, sulfonamide benzene ring along with the SO2 group having an NH2 group that is ben, what is that sulfonamide uh, again I must say um, amino group is there means this is the our prime. Uh, structure the sulfonamide sulfonamide having an acetyl group that is that's why it is known as a sulfacetamide now the synthesis is very simple and um, if we are taking the benzene this is the benzene uh, and this one the benzene benzene having a uh, what uh, amino group that means uh, what is the name of this molecule aniline this is the aniline and what is this sulfonyl chloride that is Sulfonyl chloride. That sulfonyl chloride having a, a simple pair of position attack due to the what which type of reaction? Sulf that is the electrophilic substitution reaction. That is the electrophilic substitution reaction. Reaction number first electrophilic electrophilic substitution reaction. Okay. That, that's why SO2 Cl will be introduced at the same time. Uh, acetamide is uh, treating, uh, used as a uh, treatment for this intermediate and second reaction that is the acetylation. This is the part of acetylation. Means simply acetylation. Okay, this is the acetylation. In this one the our sulfacetamide, very simple molecule. Again, one, two, three. 4, 5, 6, um, sorry, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 6. In this manner, we can give the numbering of sulfacetamide, what is, uh, how we can uh, give the IUPC name, that is acetyl part at position number N nitrogen, this one the amino means benzene sulfonamide will be suffix and acetyl para, para amino uh, benzene sulfonamide is the IPC name of that is sulfacetamide and what is um, another pathway this one the first pathway first pathway and another pathway that is the benzene uh, para amino para amino benzene sulfonamide Simply it is going to be acetylation by what is this? This is the acetic anhydride. This is acetic anhydride. And again at the acetic, as you know, the acetic anhydride used for the acetylation purpose. Simply it is acetylation purpose by CH3CO will be here. And by taking one H, it will CH3COOS will be removed, means acetic acid will be removed. And this step is known as acetylation. Acetylation. Okay, very simple reaction that is the sulfacetamide. Here, yeah, this is all about sim simply synthesis, one step synthesis and two step synthesis that is sulfacetamide and uses that is a competitive inhibitor dihydrocholate and dihydroterol synthesis and uses that is a conjunctivitis and triple sulfur component that is used for the vaginitis. Okay, this is all about what sulfacetamide. Now, I